Chicken flavor? Love it? Negro! There can only be one king of vines! It's me, bitch! It's Batch! Oh! Fuck this vine! Jerome, happy! Comedy has always been an art form where comedians have free reign to make fun or satire any subject they want to, but sometimes they overstep their bounds. The Russell Simmons endorsed Harriet Tubman sex tape skit from 2013 is a perfect example. There are some things that just aren't funny and as fans we have to let our entertainers know that the desecration of our images won't be tolerated. We especially need to let these entertainers and comedians know that cooning won't be supported in any way shape or form. With that being said, let's talk about comedian King Batch's two recent videos where he got caught cooning. King Batch is a Vine personality from Toronto, Canada. He has 15.9 million fans and a mind-blowing 6 billion views for his videos on Vine. Personally, I have no idea why he's decided to put on this display of himself. It isn't like he's a white folks comedian. He shows up in TV shows and movies predominantly aimed at black audiences. For example, Ed McGruder's Black Jesus and Nick Cannon's Wildin' Out. The folks he hangs around even seem to be socially conscious and politically aware. Fellow Vine personality The Storm Powers is a perfect example as he produces daily motivational videos and gave heartfelt comments to his Snapchat followers following the Charleston Church Massacre last year. He's connected to Nick Cannon who protested in Cleveland during the Republican National Convention and is advocating for black folks to become knowledgeable of their political power. What would possibly possess Batch to coon out like this? It literally makes no sense. Maybe he genuinely thought making monkey noises as he stole chicken from a white woman's hand and being called a negro was funny. Maybe he really believed bugging his eyes as he ran after a white woman holding a bucket of KFC chicken and watermelon was really within the limits of comedy at this tense point in the country in regards to racial relations. We really don't want to see you act like a monkey on camera, Batch. But some would ask, why does this even matter? It's just comedy. Why are you acting so serious? It does matter. I'm a fan of King Batch, and man, this isn't a good look for him. Is this what he really wants to be known for in his career? He's too talented to do his lowball comedy. He's breathing life into age-old stereotypes that plagued the media in the early 1900s. It's 2016. We're better than this. King Batch doesn't have to be Chris Rock or Jesse Williams, but the cooning needs to stop. If not, he'll be alienating a lot of his ride or die black fans. If he looks into the rise and fall of Bill Cosby, he'll see why that's not a good idea.